Hey guys, this is the battle from the Spring Friendly Tournament against Median. Let's see how the battle goes. Sorry for the shaky camera. I need to build something to hold everything in place. So I lead with Ambipom and Nidoking, and he leads with Jolteon and Melodic. I'm going to fire Fake out the Melodic because I figure he's going to switch the Jolteon out of the spot. And... I'm just going to fire an Ice Beam at that spot because I figure him to switch it into a Flying type, but he switches it into Haxorus. And Haxorus breaks the mold. Fire my Fake Out out Melodic. And then Ice Beam the Haxorus. The Haxorus goes bye bye. Ooh. So that's a dead Haxorus, and the Melodic flinched, and it's burned. And he sends out Aerodactyl in this spot. I figure him to Earthquake, so I send out the Staraptor in place of Ambipom, and I protect with the Nitto King. So I get the Aerodactyl at minus one, which I'm kind of afraid of, because it outspeeds all my Pokemon, except for my Staraptor, which is Scarfed. And here comes the Protect. And he went for a Stone Edge on the Nidoking, King, protected, and he also tried to Scald the Nidoking. King. Alright, so I'm going for a close combat on the Aerodactyl, just trying to get some neutral damage off. He switches into Jolteon. And then I switch out Nidoking King and get Ambipon back in there, because I want to get another Fake Out off. And then here comes the close combat, which probably is going to one-hit KO it, but... Whoa, that's a pretty bulky Jolteon there. What's going on? Alright, so I'm going to close combat again next turn. That's the plan. And he uses Scald on me. Does kind of an okay amount of damage. Takes burn. So my plan is to close combat, but then the Toxic Orb goes off, so I know that it has quick feed, which I don't know if it outspeeds the star after, so I have to... Fake out in this spot, which is Stab Technician. It's going to take it out. He falls, and then I get another close combat off on the Melodic. Just trying to whittle it down little by little. And he recovers in this spot. Get some of that damage off. Glad it's burned. It's, it's helping me do my job. And there it goes. So he sends out Aerodactyl. This is where I go for a double switch. I gotta... Just don't know why, just my gut tells me to. There's the Nitto King, And here comes Staraptor. Question mark. Where's the Intimidate? And then he Stone Edges a Staraptor. But it was not a Staraptor. It was my Zoroark. And the illusion wore off, and then he scalds. I knew it didn't have hydro pump, and I knew that I was more likely to survive a scald. I wasn't so afraid to switch it in in that spot. I didn't think he was going to earthquake. I go for the protect, and then he goes for the earthquake. Now, I didn't think he was an earthquake before Star Raptor was out there, and I don't think he's going to. I don't think it's an earthquake when Star Raptor's out there. So then the Zoroark dies. And then he recovers more damage off, unfortunately. Kind of annoying. Not too worried about it. I'm more worried about the Aerodactyl, which outspeeds all my Pokemon, except for the Star Raptor. But I don't know if I can one shot it. So I have to send out Ambipom. Gonna fire another fake out bullet, followed by an Ice Beam at the Aerodactyl. Just take it out. Pretty sure he's going to scald the Nitto King at this point, but if I can take the Aerodactyl out before Nitto dies, I'll be fine with that. There's a crit. Don't really need to get the flinch off, and then the Ice Beam knocks him out. Yep, bye-bye Arrow, he moved down. And then scald the Nitto King. Nitto falls, unfortunately. Oh... And then more burn damage. And then I send out Star Raptor, who's just gonna Brave Bird like there's no tomorrow. Get Intimidate off, doesn't really matter. So Star Raptor goes for the Brave Bird. 
deals pretty good damage considering everything that's going on. Damage by recoil, don't really care. Here comes the fling. Fling the King's Rock, which is going to flinch him, which guarantees Star Raptor will get another Brave Bird off. Don't have to worry about getting scalded with any added burn effect. Like, So yeah, here's Brave Bird for the win. And that is how I beat Median. Good game. Alright, have a good one, guys.